What is black magic? And how can we protect ourselves from black magic? Seer, Vodou, Kulam, Rugeria, Kalku, Obeya. Is there a difference between the terms of black magic? No. No matter the terms that are used, it all falls under the definition of black magic. As in the first part explained, black magic is always a contract between the magician and a jinn, a shaitan. We can't understand it because we can't see the jinn doing the work, and so it appears in our world as supernatural. So where and when did magic take its beginning? In the Noble Quran, the reference to magic is found in Surah Al-Baqarah, which tells the story of Prophet Suleiman peace be upon him and the two angels, Harut and Marut, who were sent to Babylon to test people's faith. They taught people magic but warned them that it was a test and that practicing magic would lead to disbelief. Despite this warning, some individuals chose to learn and practice magic, leading them astray from the path of righteousness. The beginning of black magic was with the separation of man and women. See my video named Devil Works, How, and recognize the parallels. So the question if somebody is born as a magician is no, and that it is learned and it is an act of disbelief. At this point you are out of Islam. So why then practicing black magic? These evil people practice black magic out of greed and personal gain to achieve certain goals, such as love, power, or wealth, control and manipulation, or seeking revenge. They either work for themselves or people hire them. And this all happens because of the lack of faith or knowledge and the evil nature of these people. How do they become magicians? Nowadays, being a magician is a profession and a job title. To become a magician, they have to do awful acts of disbelief for the jinn to do their part of the contract. How can we protect us and our loved ones from black magic? How do we know if someone has done black magic on us? Tell me in the comment section what do you think, and I will address it in subsequent videos and comments. Inshallah.